everybody! Welcome to Storytime with Fairfield County Library. My name is Miss Nina and I am so excited to do Storytime today. Are you guys ready? Okay! This week's theme is fall. We're going to read two books that are all about leaves and apples and pumpkins. Right, our first book is Let It Fall by Marianne Coca Leffler and published by Scholastic. Let it fall, it's autumn. Early mornings, crisp and cool, meet new friends back at school. Mounds of color raked up high, jump right in and watch the sky. But then, chilly, windy, gusty breeze, Rake, 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 the blowing leaves. See the leaves? Ooh. Let it fall, apple picking, mountain air. One next stop, the country fair. See? All those foods. Hay rides, contests, jumping fun. The winning pumpkin weighs a ton. All the fair rats. But then, brother's stroller piled high, cold and tired, say goodbye. Okay. Let it fall. Hiking, camping, what a view. Trees of orange, skies of blue. Look at all the pretty leaves. Squirrels gather, foxes hide, black bears sleep, sparrows fly. But soon, cold and frosty, tall bear trees, toes and fingers feel the freeze. Hats to knit, scarves to make, waiting for our first snowflake. Winter is coming, let it snow. And our second book is Leaves on the Trees by Tom Wiley, illustrated by Andrew Day and published by Scholastic. Now, this book is gonna be really fun because we get to sing. You guys excited? Okay, you ready? The leaves on the trees are hey. falling down, falling down, falling down. The leaves on the trees are falling down. Autumn is here. Awesome! Okay, you guys ready for the next page? The sweet gum leaves turn orange and red, orange and red, orange and red. The sweet gum leaves turn orange and red. Autumn is here. Awesome. All right, ready? Okay. The tulip leaves turn green to gold, green to gold, green to gold. The tulip leaves turn green to gold. Autumn is here. Right, you ready for the next page? Awesome. Here we go. The ginkgo leaves are shaped like fans, shaped like fans, shaped like fans. The ginkgo leaves are shaped like fans. Autumn is here. All right, ready? All right. The maple leaves are colorful. Colorful, colorful, the maple leaves are colorful. Autumn is here. The linden leaves are shaped like hearts, shaped like hearts, 
shaped like hearts. The linden leaves are shaped like hearts. Autumn is here. See how it's shaped? Yeah. All right, next one, ready? The ash tree branch has tiny leaves, tiny leaves, tiny leaves. The ash tree branch has tiny leaves. Autumn is here. All right, ready? Okay. The hickory leaves float on the pond, on the pond, on the pond. The hickory leaves float on the pond. Autumn is here. The birch leaves glow a bright yellow, bright yellow, bright yellow. The birch leaves glow bright yellow. And autumn is here. Awesome! Thank you guys for singing with me. Now, just because we're done reading doesn't mean it has to be the end of story time. So, we have story time kits that are fun, full of fun activities that have to do with the books that we read this week. Now, each story time kit will have a recipe that you can make with one of your grown-ups, a coloring sheet for you to do, and a craft. Okay, so if you want to get one of these story time kits, what you got to do is you have to come down to, to the Fairfield County Library and tell the person at the front desk that you would like a story time kit. Now, because we have two story times every week, you're going to want to tell the person at the desk that you want a kit for group A or group 1. That's going to be the kit that goes with the books that we read today. We're going to have the kits available all week starting on Mondays before story time. And we're going to have them for as long as we have our supplies. Okay? All right. My name is Nixonina, and I look forward to seeing you next week for story time. 